Shalom, all praises, honor, and glory go to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Basham Yahweh Shai, Basham Rechav Kadash, double honor, and to the apostles, the elders of great millstone, the rule well, and the thought is his truth, among many other things, and salutations to those sincere Achim out there that are going out on the highways and hedges, you know, prophesying the downfall of this wicked queendom, and that are out there, you know, waking up the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, whom are the true Hebrew Israelites that the Bible speaks of, man. You know, we are not a bunch of bywords, you know, named after uh, so-called white people, you know, the Edomites, but we are the 12 tribes of Israel, man, our forefathers, Jacob. His name is changed into Israel, and through him, you know, through his sons, you know, that's why we are, you know, the, the, the 12 tribes of Israel. But, you know, to skip the long intro, let me just jump in a few scriptures because, you know, we living in the last days of the last day, man. This is uh, just the last stretch. You see a lot of uh, people stressed out. You see governments all messed up, you know, but it's all uh, 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 what Yahweh Shai said, man. If you uh, read, you know, uh, Matthew 24, you're going to read about, the uh, you know, wars, rumors of wars. You know, people uh, love waxing cold. You know, in the book of Matthew, it's, it all speaks about that but in the book of Ezra. And we're living in that time, man. The Most High is really, you know, uh, visiting the place that he has created, man. And you see that there's, there's many, many uh, yeah, uproars, you know, in Russia. You have uh, people, uh, you know, responding to uh, put in his uh, move to, uh, you know, come with the draft, man. Because he, he wants people, he wants 300,000 people in the army. 300,000, you know, and the people ain't feeling it, you know, yet. So, <laughs> but uh, without playing around, let me just uh, go into a few scriptures because, you know, we uh, need to just keep it, you know, keep it moving, man, and keep pushing. Like the elder apostle Ricard always says, man, you know, you push on. You need to just keep it moving. And let me, I was thinking about the scripture. This is going to be, y'all, this is short and to the point. So, let me jump down into uh, as many beautiful scriptures in here, man. But let me jump down to what I was uh, going to read without going all left and right. Just stick to the things that, uh, that popped into this in my spirit man to the spirit Yahweh dissolve Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai man so all right Romans 8 verse 35 who so who shall separate us from the love of Yahweh Shai Masayah shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or nakedness or peril or or sword you know and these these things are all happening right now man you can just pick a spot in the world and there's this uh, either uh, people protesting, there's uh, war, there's famine, the electric, uh, electricity is going, uh, you know, that, that bill is going sky high, man. People are, are, are protesting, burning the bills in, in, in Italy. People over here are, 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 are lamenting. <laughs> it's for, you know, for me, it's beautiful, man. You know, because this is the downfall of Esau's kingdom. This wicked queendom is falling down, man. And systematically, these devils are, you know, uh, bringing down this uh, economy. You know, the keepers of the house are bringing down uh, the economy, man. They're breaking down this whole system so that they, so that they can usher in the RFID chip. Because everything's being, now, you know, people are focusing on Putin and all that. But, you know, he's a devil too. Don't forget that, man. And he's going to go into captivity as well. You know, Vladimir Putin will go into slavery, man. All of them will go into slavery because they are the Edomites. They're the enemies. They're the heathen. The world to come is for Yahshua, Allah, man. It's for the children of Israel, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans spread around the four corners of the earth and that believe in Yahweh, Basham, Yahweh, Those people, man. It's for them. And even them two-thirds are going to come back through the elect, man. 
It's all for Yashar, the world without end, man. Like the book of Isaiah, uh, you know, states that Isaiah 45 and 17 or 45 and 7. But these things, tribulation, distress, persecution, famine, nakedness, or peril, sword, you know, all these things are, 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 you know, if you take a look at, you know, tribulation, you know, that, uh, 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 you know, Esau's already cracking down on, you know, YouTube, on the videos, on the on apostles and elders. You know, he tries to stop the truth, but he can't do nothing against the truth but for it, man. Like the book of Corinthians states, you know, Amos 8 and 11 on down. You know, it's the famine of the word, man. It's all by design of Yahweh Basham Yahushai, man. <laughs> what can you do against the against the Mosai? He is the one that created everything. He created everything through his son, you know, but he made the blueprint. And everything that you see now spring, uh, you know, budding or uh, springing up, you know, and, 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 and all the words are now being manifested because the most high in the man that he should lie. Everything that he said will come to pass, man, because the most high in the liar, man. Men lie. The most high doesn't lie, man. You know, if you believe it or not, hey, we believe that, man. The most high in the liar, the, the men that are ruling this earth, they are the liars. Men on the earth are liars, man. We all in this, uh, you know, these bodies, man, these bodies, demons, all types of things that mess up your mind, you know, all types of things that you see on the TV, that you hear on the radio, that you see on the billboards, it's all messing with your mind. Different colors, sirens going off, all that is, a, it, 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 all these vibrations, Esau's bombing you with, you know, to keep you in a certain, uh, on a low vibration, man. You know, so it's time to snap out, out of that because it's high time to wake up out of sleep, man. So let me go to who shall separate us from the love of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. Let's go to the word separate, poriso in the Greek, to separate, divide, part asunder, to separate oneself from. You know, it's like to leave husband or wife or divorce to depart, to go away. You know, to place room between. The Most High is fixing us up, man. And he's fixing up the breaches. You know, uh, the northern and the southern kingdom are being put together, man. You know? Judah, Benjamin, Levi, all them, uh, 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 you know, the southern tribes. And the ones that are from the northern tribes. All the so-called Latinos. You know, you have Manasseh, you have uh, uh, Asher. You know, you have uh, um, the so-called... Uh, uh, Mexicans, which are, uh, just to name a few, you know, Issachar, Issachar you know, Ephraim, you know, so-called uh, uh, Puerto Ricans, you know, if a, a lot of, you know, people in South America are waking up, man, brothers are waking up in, uh, from correct Colombia, you know, it's a beautiful thing, man, you see the spirit is really moving, you know, so we're waking up, man, all of them tribes, I didn't name all of them, but all of us, are starting to see what's going on because that's part of prophecy, man. You know, in the land of our captivity, we shall remember Yahweh Basham Yahushai. We shall remember ourselves. There's no more Jeremiah 17 and 4, you know, the, that we uh, are now uh, in a state, that we are in a state of uh, being uh, ignorant of who we are and who we should worship, first and foremost. Yahweh Basham Yahushai. The most high, he is restoring his people, man. He is making up his jewels. He's going to fix us up, man. He's fixing us up, but he's really going to fix us up when he establishes the kingdom through his son, Yahweh Shai, man. We're going to rule. We're going to be beautiful again, man. You know? It's not going to be make America great again. It's going to be make Yashara great again, man. I don't even want to use that line, but hey, they they are saying all types of things. They think that their houses shall continue forever, but it's going to be they are going to uh, depart and go away into captivity, man. And clean up all of their, their, their bullshit, man. So who shall separate us from the love? You know, the word love goes into agape. is affection, goodwill, benevolence, brotherly love, you know? So who's going to separate us from the love of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai? Tribulation, you know, all these things that they bring upon us. What did the Lord say, you know? If you come to serve the Heavenly Father, you need to uh, prepare yourself for temptation, for tribulation, you know, for persecution, you know, for, for hardship, man. 
You need to have patience. Different scriptures all explain these things, man. Having patience means to suffer, to sit through things, man, and watch situations just, uh, you know, evolve while you are being molded by it, you know? Oppressing, pressing together, pressure. You see? Metaphorically, oppression, affliction. The servant is not greater than his master. The Lord went through many things, man. You know, everyone needs to bear his cross. Everyone has his uh, lot that he needs to fulfill in uh, Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. You need to go through things to be able to receive, uh, uh, you know, the, the kingdom of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. Eternal life. Like the elder apostle Ramlop, he said it back in the days. You know, or back in the days, like a, 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 a while ago. Like, what is. A few years, a few hundred years with this goddamn devil. You well, didn't say it like that, but hey, <laughs> I was thinking about it. <laughs> you know, well, but it's a few years, you know, uh, with this uh, with this damn devil in comparisons with forever, with everlasting life. You know, this is a small investment, man. This is a small thing that we have to go through, man. Really. You know, and this is common to man. If you think about it, the scriptures talk about it, man. And the most I will always find a way to... Uh, for you to escape to the temptation, man, the hardship. But this this is a trial, man, of your mind. Of your mind, you you know, are you gonna show yourself, men? You know, faithful. You know, are you gonna be faithful, men and women, doing your best to please the the Lord, Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. You know, having that faith, man, in that He's gonna deliver us, that He's gonna keep us in the time to come. Jacob's trouble. You know, when while people are. Going berserk, wanted to be on dope. We are prisoners of hope, man. Not prisoners of dope, you know. <laughs> These people in the world, they are on opioids, on all types of, you know, uh, GMO weed, all types of crazy shit, man. Drinking themselves or to the to they just just totally out of it. And you can drink, but you need to do it, uh, uh, you know, with, with measure. The scriptures talk about that, man. Of course, you can, you know, you can literally be, you know, high or whatever, you know, concerning the drink, you know, inside joke. You know, brother always, always say, like, you know, you, you get high off this drink, you know. You shouldn't be, like, sloppy, sloppy drunk. But, hey, everyone has his thing. But, hey, drink with measure. Or else you're going to get into maybe quarrels and all that. You know, the book of Sirach speaks about that. You know, but wine is made to make men 